Hello, this is Smitha and we are going to talk about 30 minutes to COVID. Not the COVID that you're thinking about. Let's always meet each other with a smile. For the smile is the beginning of love, says Mother Teresa. So COVID with a smile, yes. I'm not going to talk about the COVID, which is a challenging pandemic all over the world and you find how this has been going on for a while and we haven't found a, a vaccine for it. It is vulnerable. It has affected a lot of people globally and you also find how indomitable it is changing shapes and I would call it as a demon that has separated all of us. So let me put it this way. COVID with a smile is champion one vital idea delightfully. If you cannot do great things, do small things in a great way, says Napoleon Hill. So let's start with ourselves. Let us know ourselves, what we are, and let us analyze us. Knowing yourself is the beginning of wisdom, says Aristotle. That is why we should know ourselves. So what do you do during your free time? Uh, do you like photography? Do you like cooking? What is your hobby? Is gardening or reading one of your hobbies? So let us find out in detail. What do you value more? A dream or just a success? What do you think has changed you from the you two years or two months before? What has made a transformation in you? Is there a scope for leading a fulfilled life amidst COVID? Yes, definitely. What is your role in your family? What will it be in near future? So you may be a son, daughter today, but you may be something else. What's your role in your society? What will be in the near future? Lot to think. Now, your passion, chase it. Chase your passion, something that interests you. Spend every day 30 minutes for your passion and you have to do it regularly. Every day, regular is not skipping even a day. Never skip. Do you skip brushing your teeth or taking bath? Never, right? Keep a record, everything in writing or image or video or mind map or monograph, whatever, keep it in writing. Check your progress instantly, compare it. First day, day three, day five, compare it. Give it to others to review, others' experiences, add your value. Nothing great in the world has ever been accomplished without passion, says George Hegel. So proceed with your passion to be a champion. Champion? How could you be a champion? Be prepared. Doing every day your exercise, your practice, you will be prepared. You will break all the obstacles. That's why you will be called a champion. Build your personality. Know your strengths and weaknesses. Change your weaknesses into strengths. Bury all your doubts and fears about you. Don't think you can't do. Think you can. Better try and keep knocking all the doors of opportunity. You will find one. Better try. Be you. Be your original self. Don't copy others. Be you. Champions are made from something they've deep inside of them. A desire, a dream, a vision, says Mahatma Gandhi. So you can Google, search, find whatever you wanted to, to be interested in through those online courses or through internet or YouTube. So keep searching. Bye-bye. Thank you.